Hey, what's going on, y'all? Jimmy Macrum. It's time for episodes 14 and 15 of Vendland Saga. Where do we begin? A couple of you upset with me about my feelings on Canute. Listen, I, I understand now where he's coming from. Yes, I blame Ragnar mostly. Well, his dad mostly, the king. Ragnar right after that, uh, even though Ragnar meant well. Um, and then Canute. And yes, I now understand that he has a, a mind that works logically. I'm shocked that he takes his position so seriously and know that his words have power way more power than the average person however how does that explain him cowering behind people when he talks you know what I'm saying even as a regular 16 year old if you were scared you knew you couldn't cower you know what I mean like even f- appearing f- to say face whatever Canute is growing on me we'll say we'll get there and we heard about um, Ashalad's plan of not letting the Danes into Wales under any circumstances. All right, let's get to it. Jesus, aren't we starting off fast? Violence. Who is this and what is she doing? Whoever that is, is so goddamn dead. It's not even funny. Close! <laughs> 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 what the art style looks so different? Was it just me? Looks close to like One Punch Man. Anata wa watashi no hai go mamotte kudasai masu ka? Ah? Nani itte da? Ani to dakara yareru nda. Kore ga mo meppo tsuyogatta. Ore ra wa soude de kakatta nda ga. He gave all you the business, sir. You all got washed. Da to shitara mukatsuku. すか、選手としての礼儀ってもんがよ。ジーズス。本当の戦士に剣はいらない。あ、とかなんとか。お、ハスキーのトーズ。なんなんだよ、坊主よ。セルシス、スペリアプリスト。天気の文句を私に言われ
ちゃんと良い子にしてないと神様が罰を。おお、ヨーロン。チーズ。晩ご飯、拝見。ほいしったですよ。エピソードは何だね何だと違うの大麦のミルクがゆと干し肉が少々言うの前に玉。ディスカスティング。釣りして。間違えた。食い物全部。ああ、そうそう。なあ、ヘッドインターネクスウィーク。食い物全部出せ。殺すぞ。So、I like how never pretending like they're good guys. There's no softening of、uh, what the things actually did. わしらの言葉の通じるものはおらんか。Can I give it to him? 赤ん坊もおるんだどうか赤ん坊か。そりゃ大変だな。It's hard. It's really hard. Who you go, she knows, she pay you, she knocked it. Oh, shh. Oh, Tony, hold Tony. Line and more, Saline and more, who you go, she knows, she pay you. Story the Motas so Saratara, Texas, no man, no other Motas, it will go to a chicken. So it's I, Tadakene. You're really not sure, Codness at all. Yare. Terrific. Would have that wrong. Everybody but her died. So, you know, that the other said, Doki Doki stood on the m o What? What? Holy, I'm gonna send the Hanusian come me tiny. That's it. I'm a Doki Doki stood on. What? That might be. That might be the greatest character related、uh, character beat plot twist <laughs> I've seen in a long time. That was like. Jamie Lannister at the end of the Game of Thrones opening episode. It was just like. What? I look at you in a totally different way, and all it took was a minute. What? What? Pardon me? I feel elated. I was like, oh no, is that a bad translation? Now I gotta go look at what she actually said. She meant exactly what she said. What? And I find it odd that she didn't say happy. Elated, like. Relieved almost. Beyond. It's a different realm of. Not quite happiness. What? Oh my god. I gotta look her name up because、so、I didn't catch it at all. What? For the moment, I might call her just psycho. Nut job. That little thing where she stole the ring. Not afraid of going to hell. She's gonna throw it. Refuses. She just can't do it. I am really curious what happens to her. Like, I'm thoroughly curious. I said they weren't、um, sugarcoating how the Vikings were. And then it got even darker. <sighs> Episode 15. Let's get to it. そうか。クヌートは死んだか。What? All right, here's some stuff. 正確、殿下とおぼしき姿は敵軍中に認められずとのことです。うん。生き延びて救助を待っておるやもしれんが。Very true. 兄のハラルドを上回る器量を持ち合わせていたならば。
行方知れずになどならずに済んだ It was war! It was war, basically! かもしれんな You're an animal Oh, 雪が降る戦争が終わる<笑>冬よお前は戦士の心を凍らせるのかおー、冬よ大将焼き豚と煮豚、どっちく両方、oh. あれを勝ち上げて新王朝旗揚げとかよ兵隊集めるだけでも効き目あるぜまあんたがみこしの担ぎ手なら I love that pretty much that pretty much establishes、uh, Ashlad as、uh, at least a few steps to everybody else as far as long term thinking goes おーせ王子取られんだったらイングランド軍にくれてやってもよかったなあ<笑>何よ困った人だなあんたは。By the way, was last episode、uh, 14? Was that the first one without any Thorfinn at all? デンマークがイングランドを飲み込むんだ。貴族どもは王権を捨ててでも戦争を終わらせたいらしい。うわぁ。悪い予感。ベルルだ漁師様はおられるかえ ?Alright, was adorable. 何のために無力な私たちを試されるのですか、父よ。私の声はあなたの耳に届いているのでしょうか This priest is such a sad character. 我が子を我が子を愛おしく思わぬ父親など平気のこった村民の話によると敵兵はおおよそ100から200人すで、right. に近隣の兵が向かっておるそうですが、oh, shit. カイロと見せかけて陸路でゲインズ払い。雪を振り込められて急速中ってとこが。ジュッドーコが。いつかぶんでいいや。こ、こうか。よしよし。面白いぞ。いそうさけんか。うまくすると。まだまだ楽しめるかもな。Fucking mine. I actually used the thing in 俺、おい I can't tell if you're trying to be half hopeful. He's trying to get some rabbit. I won't. 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 I だが陛下は召し上がるどころか激しくお怒りになった王の子が癒しき奴隷の真似事をするな王陛下もお忙しかったのでしょう戦が終わったら鳥料理でも作ってお持ちしましょうきっとよ何鳥だ鳥の名だ I like that he knows how to cook I can't tell if Ragnar just trying to be nice or if he actually thinks they can't be appreciative He won't be どういうことじゃこの村に潜んでまだ10日だろ、like、なぜバレた知るかよなの<笑>この後に及んでまだ敵地を進むと抜かすかアシェラと連れてこい今すぐだ今は前世で、ね、<笑>案内しますよけーったく狩猟が狩猟なら部下も部下だ口の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の力の
すまねえなとんがり頭アシロットの命令だなんやるかい俺らは構わねえけどよどうしたんだよ急げ伺いましょうその遺言本えい、hey. How are you, sir? 人払いしますか You're such a piece of shit. I love you. そして貴殿の死がさらなる成長を促すでしょうお役目は今日から私が引き継ぎますイングランド兵に殺された貴殿の代わりにね<笑>クヌート殿下は一方の派閥の旗頭にされておるもう一方はクヌート様の兄にみのハラルドさん両殿下のうちどちらかを殺そうとうん、スベモが王子をこたび王陛下は殿下を戦場へ伴ったのは殿下を戦死させるためだおおシェッ殺せよクヌート殿下の真の敵は今やお父上のスベモ王陛下その人なのだねえ、ね、なんてこと早く。All right, that was episodes 14 and 15 of Vinland Saga. <sighs> Where to begin? First things first. At the end of episode 13, towards the end, we found out that、uh, Ashlad hates the Danes, that he is、uh, acting with his own goals in mind about protecting this land. They won't step one foot in here. And I think quite a few people. Me, I could go out of the way. But quite a few people probably、um, warmed up, maybe? Warmed up to Ashland because of that? Or he's not just this Viking who cares about you know, riches and yada yada yada. He's got a more noble, at the very least, goal in mind. However, <laughs> it is what it is. However, There are things you have to do if you want to do what he wants. That goes for everything in life. Well, at least back in the day. Like back in the day, if you wanted to be a supermodel, you had to fucking eat and throw it up. <laughs> if you didn't want to do that because it's impossibly unhealthy and it's a terrible idea, then you just don't. And you understand that because if you're not willing to do that, you're probably not going to get the upper tier jobs. So, Ashlad wants to protect the land he's from, his mother's land. So, to do that, he needs Prince Canute to be the king so then he can get a high position. So, to do that, certain things have to be done. Ragnar needs to be murdered.、Um, he needs to keep his fucking crew happy. To keep his crew happy, you've got to raid and murder civilians. I just think he's a man who understands what he wants. He understands that there are rules to the game. And he's willing to pay the cost. Now, I liked him before the, the、uh, Wales Lydia revelation. But I can imagine if, if 13 brought you around on him, 14 and 15 reminded you very quickly that he is cold blooded. It is what it is. In fact, He's so cold, I think he may come across as even worse than the Danes. I don't think he is. I'm just saying. He may come across that way. Because while you can see a lot of them are happy when they're fighting or killing and things like this, I don't think I've seen Ashley crack a smile during anything violent once. He's rather like, it is what it is. Okay. At least you won't suffer anymore. You ain't got to worry about this winner or any other winner from here on out. It's over. Why? Well, because if we leave any fucking survivors, 
they're going to tell and reveal a position. That's bad, so they have to go. It's a cold world, boy. I feel bad for Canute. Even worse than I did at the end of uh, 13. Because while 13 kind of showed us that he has a brain in there, that he is, um, if not smart, he is aware of his surroundings, his position. Um, 14 and 15 showed that he is aware of how his dad feels about him. That a father has to love his son. That's not just a... A you know naive thing a, a kid would say. That's somebody who wants that to be true, but knows it probably isn't. I think with the food was awful. Could have worse. Could have hit him. I'm glad he didn't. But uh, he was so happy, <laughs> so happy to show his dad the food and just uh, get out of here. Now if I got my own sense, if you don't mind, I do think Ashland's right. I think we all can agree there that Ragnar, while he's done his absolute best to protect Canute, overall, he has held him back socially. There are quite a few skills he needs to be a king that he does not have because Ragnar has babied him, for lack of a better word. Now, the babying has kept him alive. That's a win. But... We just gotta keep it a buck. He's not as far along as he would be if Ragnar was a um, less emotionally attached and more practical. Unfortunately for Knut, uh, Ashlad is all the way practically attached, and I doubt it'd be very much emotional. He's a means to an end. Wow. What a show. What a show. I'm so happy. Not happy, that was awful, but you know what I mean. Impressed. I'm like, the, I'm like homegirl. I'm elated. Jesus. Anyway, uh, post your comments down below. Like, share, subscribe. 